Hello, here at Suprema, we're looking to revolutionize biometric security market. This year, we have released two key products that will serve as a cornerstone of the revolution. First, we released Biostar 2, our biometric open security platform that will serve as a basis for all the future terminals to come. Second, we have released Biostation 2, our ultra high performance fingerprint access control and time attendant terminal. Here we have Biostation 2 that will change how biometrics are infused with security. Now Biostation 2 is highlighted by its reliability and high performance. It proves this by its ability to maintain high performance even when it's pushed against its limits. The most important aspect of physical security is securing scalability and reliability within the system. Also, one of the key elements that helps to achieve such characteristics is high performance of the system. Biostar 2, architecture philosophy was based on securing such aspects. And to demonstrate, we have prepared a simulation where 500 Biostation 2 terminals will process 20,000 users at a single site. As you can see, that there are 20,000 users currently enrolled within the system. Biostar 2 is built with efficiency in mind and is optimized to operate on little resource as possible. We'll test the system by transferring 20,000 users to 500 devices at once to see the power of the new system architecture. The system is currently conducting a total of 10 million user data transfers. You can see that the system is using very little resource. The asynchronous data transfer mechanism ensures that the data is transferred quickly and the device doesn't have to go offline during the process. I will show you that you can still go ahead and use the terminal while the transfer is taking place. As you can see, the terminal is usable while the transfer is taking place. Now that the transfer is complete, we'll experiment the high traffic environment with commuting hour scenario that will push the limits of the system. For this experiment, we have loaded a test firmware and switched on auto identification mode of the device. The devices are currently reporting authentication entries randomly across the system. We'll check by looking at the real-time log reports that are being updated on the system. As you can see, that even while the network and the system is being put through its paces, the server is operating normally. Now we'll demonstrate one of the key strengths of Biostar 2, which are its ability to cope under network failures. Even when in case of network failure, the distributed intelligence of the system will allow the terminals to continue provide secure access and collect logs. Once the network has been recovered, the locally collected logs will be transferred to the system automatically without hassle. Now we'll demonstrate by disconnecting network connection between the server and the device by unplugging the network cables. The system show that the devices are disconnected and the logs are no longer being recorded. Even though that the network is disconnected, the device will still function normally. Now I'll go ahead and authenticate on one of the devices. As you can see, the device is functioning normally. 
and they are authenticating and collecting logs locally on the device. Once we re-establish the network, the system will restore the connection to all of the devices quickly and resend the logs from where the connection was lost. With what we are able to achieve through BioStar 2, we now truly offer a system that will ensure reliability and high performance in any condition through optimization and new architectural design. We view BioStar 2 as a revolution and new direction of what security software can achieve and in many ways, a new beginning.